everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and a bit of a different video for you today. This is a group test of three BlackBerry 9900 or BlackBerry 9930 smartphone cases from otterbox.com. So they're all for the same phone. I wanted to show you the different features across the range. So let's start off with this biggest one first. This is the Defender series case. And let's open this one up. Stunning looking case. This is one of their really sort of tough cases. So this is the Defender. Let's take this off of the backing. There we go. So we have the Defender on the left. And let's get this next one out. This is the Commuter, again from Otterbox. So we have the commuter, nice looking case, bit more slimline this one. Let's just uh, take this off of the packaging. There we go. So this is the commuter. All the different price points, the prices do vary. I'm not going to tell you the prices in this video because um, if you shop around, use Google product search and you'll find the best prices you can. Now this last one I'm taking out of the box is the Impact series. And again, let's just remove this little cardboard portion from the bottom and we can get into the Impact Series. So as you can see, they're quite different cases. If you look at this one here, which is the Defender, you can see some similarities between the two. It almost looks like this is the inside portion of this one. Uh, this one here, which is the Commuter Series, is more of a slimline case with a hard outer shell with some silicon rubber in the middle. So let's look at all of these individually. Defender series first. Uh, this consists of sort of quite a sturdy belt clip on the back. That is a very sturdy belt clip. And then round on this side here, we can sort of remove this portion of the case. So this sort of acts separately to the actual case for the product. Inside here, we've got a uh, sort of clear screen protector and an installation card and a little cloth for wiping the screen so that's good for the 9900 and 9930 because it's a touch screen device and then this is the inner portion of the case itself and this is where you sort of peel this wrap around section off the outside of the case and then we're going to separate these two portions uh, I always struggle getting in these but if you just work your way around the little tabs you can get into it quite easily so this is how this sort of comes apart and we're still working on the Defender, so this is the Defender case. And then we're going to pop the BlackBerry 9900 into the case. And then we're going to put the front on. And the whole idea of uh, the Otterbox uh, range of cases is, that, is they offer varying degrees of protection um, at different price points. And this is sort of probably going to give you the best protection of the lot. So we've got the sort of inside hard case on. So this is really going to protect the device. And then we're going to put the impact part. So this is like the silicon rubber part. And this is what seals around all of the various ports. So we just sort of work our way around and make sure that all of these parts are on the case properly. Like so. And we just got to really just manipulate the case into the little slots until they are all there. And there we go. So this is actually in the case, good and proper now. And I can give you a look around the case now. So as I said, this is the Otterbox Defender. And if we look on this side, we can see that the volume up and down and the mute switch is covered. We've got another button covered here. Access to the microphone there, so that remains uncovered. And then on the side, you can normally peel these back. So we've got access to the charging port. And then if we peel this one back, we've got access to the uh, three and a half millimeter audio jack and then on the top we've got a raised section for that sleep wake button obviously the screen still remains completely accessible and there's a cutout on the back for the flash and the camera and let's just put this into the case so it will only go in facing inwards like so so this is fully protected now if this is clipped 
onto a belt there's no way at all any damage is going to occur to the handset this uh, belt clip also rotates so you can have it on your belt in landscape or portrait orientation and then to remove the phone we just have to sort of ease it out of the case or we can go in from the top edge actually to take it out from the case so completely covered not sure why this bit is here that sort of lines up with one of the buttons does it let's have a look actually lines up with this button here so I'm not sure why that is it probably is a smart lock feature for the screen maybe something like that correct me if I'm wrong but this is their ultimate protection case so very nice case indeed so let's get this case off and then we'll move on to the next case okay so moving on this is the commuter case from otterbox.com bit more of a slimline design than the previous one uh, offers up still a good amount of protection but certainly less protection than the Defender. Let's just take um, this outer cover off. And see how this case is constructed. So we've got a hard sort of outer shell. And then we've got this inner silicon portion to the case. And then inside here we're going to have the same sort of accessories. So let's just open this up. And we have got the screen protector, the little microfiber cloth, and the applicator. So we've popped that to one side. And then fitting the case in, uh, or the phone in this case, is a lot simpler in the fact that we are going to just offer the phone up to the case and slide it into place, like so. So this is what it's like just in the silicon part, but the, the case doesn't work like this. We really need to get it inside the hard outer shell as well. So we're gonna pop this in bottom edge first, and then just ease these sections in. Actually, we're, go, we're going control side first, because that's obviously gonna be the most difficult to get in. And then we will ease this top portion over. It's a tricky one to fit this actually. So here we go, there we go, we're making some progress now. And then we just gotta ease it over here and then ease that bottom edge onto the case and we're there. So there we go, this is the BlackBerry 9900 inside the commuter series case from Otterbox. Gives a nice amount of protection around these front edges so there's really no problem with these front edges. I've just noticed here that this button didn't go inside. There we go, that's better. So we've got protruding sections here coming through the hard case to reveal the buttons on this side. And then on the top, we've got that sleep wake button again. And on this side, we've got covered portions again. This is really nice. So we can open these up to gain access to that earphone socket and also the uh, micro USB socket as well. On the back, we have got a really nice Otterbox logo on the back, cutouts for the camera and the flash, so that's really nice, like that. And I think this is probably a cutout here for the tiny little microphone for picking up audio when you're doing video. So that's really nice, I like this a lot. So on the corners we've obviously got the impact protection from the rubber, and then we've got this hard back casing. Feels nice in the hand. Um, Personally, I wouldn't need this amount of protection from the Defender, so the commuter is a really nice compromise between the bulk of the Defender and the uh, sort of impact protection that the silicon sort of rubber inside the case actually offers. This is a nice case. So now let's move on to take a look at the Impact series case from Otterbox. So now I'm going to be showing you the Impact series case from Otterbox and this hasn't got a out, hard outer shell or anything this is purely the soft sort of uh, silicon type rubber case that we sort of familiarize ourselves with most cases that are going to give some sort of protection to your handset. Now we've got the same packaging inside and in here I will show you just so you see Otterbox do include a screen protector, applicator card and the little polishing cloth as well and this hasn't got any hard outer protection so very very easy to get your phone into it we're just going to offer that top edge up first and then just ease it round the base of the handset 
like so. Now this is quite nice in the fact that it does cover this bottom portion just underneath the spacebar, so you get a little extra bit of protection down here. We've got a raised edge profile design again around the screen. Um, now all of these mean that if you're going to place your handset face down the screen's not going to touch the desk or table. Cutouts here for the earphone speaker, raised sections for all of the buttons as you can see here. And then we've got the Otterbox logo on the back with a cutout for the camera, the mic and the flash. And then this one hasn't got any covers for these two ports, so these remain open at all times. So you've got access to your micro USB and 3.5mm audio jack. And then finally on the top we've got a raised button again for that sleep wake button. And it works nicely through the case as well, no issues there at all. So of the three cases, this feels probably the most slippery in the hand but it does feel as though it would give more protection than this, but probably not. They pro these two probably uh, offer up similar amounts of protection. Um, so this, just to remind you, is the com commuter, and this is the impact. Just give you a look at those two side by side. So this is like a soft inner and the hard outer, and then this is all the soft silicon rubber with no outer going around it. I like all of the cases, actually. I do like them all. Out of the three, if I was choosing one, which one would I choose? Well... I'm not a heavy user, I'm not sort of working on industrial sites or in any sort of mega hard activity, so I probably wouldn't choose that. But if I was, the Defender is the ultimate protection out of the three. For me, I would probably have to choose between these two, which is the Commuter series and the Impact series. And I would probably choose the Commuter out of the three for me, purely because it's very thin, very lightweight, uh, has this hard shell, which I like, and has the covers on the side port so I'd probably choose that one but they're all fantastic cases this has been my review of the Defender series the Commuter series and the Impact series cases for the BlackBerry 9900 or 9930 all of them from otterbox.com big thumbs up to them for sending me these devices to review thank you very much for watching I'll see you all again in the next video